I love this printer, but it seems like every fourth or fifth time I print to it, it draws so much power that it knocks out the electricity. My circuit breaker pops. And I don't think it's the printer's fault. I think it's my wiring or something. So I bought this a voltage stabilizer off the UPS off of, off of Amazon. I'm hoping that this resolves the issue. So I'm going to use this for a while. And if my printer doesn't cut out the electricity, I don't have any more circuit breaker pops, this video will eventually get posted. So if you're seeing this video, that means this worked, at least over the course of a month. Oh, in one room, check out how much stuff I have plugged in. All right, so there's a, there's a UPS right there with one, two, three, four, five, six items plugged in. Then we got that on the wall there with four items plugged in. Underneath here, we have that strip with four items. Uh, that strip under there with, I don't know, it looks like that one's full. We also have a strip there, a strip there, and a strip here. That's a lot of stuff plugged in so that when my printer wants to print, it draws a lot of electricity to fuse that paper up. And uh, that's why I need this. I, I tried going less expensive. This thing is, I think, under 40 bucks, maybe under 50. I'm pretty sure a line conditioner would resolve it, but I didn't want to spend that kind of money. So I'm going cheap to see if I could fix it with this. Uh, it seems at least, at least once a week, my printer, uh, when we print to it, the circuit breakers click, pop, bang, all the power goes out for a couple of rooms and I got to reboot it. I've done it so much that I've shortened the life of this printer because it's, it's just cut off so many times. The paper gets stuck in the paper tray and I have to pull the toner out, pull the paper out. So I, I really like this printer. I want it to last for years. Uh, I did a video on it on my, on this channel. So. So what I'm hoping to get out of this, it says protects equipment from brownout, surges, spikes. So if it protects it from a brown, I wonder, I wonder if it almost behaves somewhat like a UPS device. Bucket boost LED display, four outlets, two adapter outlets, telephone fax protection too. All right, so here's what this bad boy looks like. Opt the UPS. Where's the plugs? Plugs, well, there's the plug, there's the holes. So three, six, two of them are different than the other four. I got to read up on that. There's the off on. So it's pretty basic. We'll see if it does the job. So I just printed 14 pages and I noticed the boost kicked in that amber light below a few times. I, I didn't start recording but uh, until I noticed it a few times. So this thing seems to be performing some kind of a function. And I almost wonder if my power would have kicked out three times because that's how many times I counted it blinking. So the final conclusion on this item is I've been printing now for two straight weeks and printing, which it seemed like every five prints, my electricity would go out and I'd have to go reset the circuit breaker the circuit breaker has not popped for two weeks and I've done plenty of printing. This thing has done the job. And I'm gonna buy another one for my other room because <laughs> I need it in there too. Because now, now that this room doesn't trip, the other room does uh, because I put a, a new TV in there. Well, it's actually an old TV, whatever the case is. I could recommend this thing. This thing has saved the life of this. If you'd like to purchase one of these, I've placed a link in the description below to the exact item I purchased. Thank you for watching Tech Nuba. Tech Nuba.